Dear friends, you are welcome to our YouTube channel eGarden India. Today we are discussing 50 important multiple choice questions with answers of communicative English. Please like the video and share with your friends. Also subscribe our channel. Let us start the video. Question number one. A sentence is a collection of dash words. Answer meaningful. Question number two. Different forms of the same lexeme generally dash in meaning. Answer differ. Question number three. The subject is the dash of a sentence. Answer Topic Question number 4. The predicate is that part of the sentence that shows an dash or a dash. Answer Action and relationship. Question number five. An object can be of two types, namely dash and dash. Answer direct and indirect. Question number six. An indirect object answers the question does or does whom what answer two and four question number seven a clause is a pair of group of words that consist of a Dash and a dash. Subject and predicate. Question number eight. And dash clause is that part of the sentence which may very well stand alone. Answer independent. Question number nine. Dash sentences are also known as affirmative sentences. Answer positive. Question number ten. And dash is used to express an emotional utterance, utterance answer exclamation mark question number 11 dash interrogatives are those questions sentences that offer two or more alternative responses answer alternative question number 12 normally we use dash to introduce the passive object Answer by Question number 13 Dash voice is the voice used when the subject is the recipient of the action Answer passive Question number 14 Whenever you use dash, 
speech in writing or speaking the words spoken or written are put in inverted commas answer direct question number 15 words are spoken or written in this ways answer 2 question number 16 the most important point to change a direct speech into an indirect speech is to the dash answer tense question number 17 reporting verbs like dash are used while recording indirect speech answer tell say ask question number 18 in case of change of pronoun i becomes dash he or she question number 19 in case of pronoun we becomes dash answer they question number 20 in case of change of adverb dash becomes the next day answer tomorrow question number 21 in case of change of adverb dash becomes that day answer today question number 22 the more we does in english the better it would be for us to improve our vocabulary answer is pick question number 23 does reading will sharpen both general and subject specific vocabularies answer varied question number 24 present is a dash syllable word answer 2 question number 25 native english speakers do not always dash on where to put the stress kush answer agree question number 26 the dash voice is the normal voice answer active question number 27 dash nouns refer to some groups of countable nouns substances feelings and types of activity answer uncountable question number 28 a dash is often defined as a word which shows action or state of being answer verb question number 29 verbs tell if something has 
does happen if it will happen later or it if it is happening now answer already question number 30 verbs dash their form answer change question number 31 adverbs tell you dash and dash or dash something is done how where when question number 32 adverbs of frequency answer the questions does answer how many times question number 33 prepositions dash their forms answer never change Question number 34 Since and for are used to express dash Answer extended time Question number 35 This pronouns should be used only when the refer back to another word in the sentence answer reflexive question number 36 object of above refers to the dash person is in the sentence answer same question number 37 dash pronouns are used if the rename the subject answer subjective question number 38 coordinating conjunctions always come dash the words or clauses that the join answer between question number 39 dash clause cannot exist alone answer dependent question number 40 a dash article is mostly used to refer to an object or person that has been previously introduced answer definite Question number 41 N dash is a word used to express strong sudden feelings. Answer interjection. Question number 42 An interrogative adjective is like N dash pronoun except that it modifies a noun or noun phrase rather than standing on its own answer interrogative question number 43 adjectives modify a noun or a pronoun by dash dash or dash words answer describing identifying and quantitative quantifying question number 44 dash tense is used to present dissatisfaction of the past answer past perfect
क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी फाइव परमानेंट सिचुएशन आर शाउन बाय डेस्टेंस आंसर सिंपल प्रेजेंट क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी सिक्स ए कंप्लीट एक्शन बिफोर अनदर एक्टिविटी इन द पास्ट इज शाउन बाय डेस्टेंस आंसर पास्ट परफेक्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी सेवन डैश डिग्री एक्सप्रेस इज ए हायर डिग्री आंसर कंपेरेटिव क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी एट डैश एक्सप्रेस इज ए मैक्सिमल डिग्री आंसर सुपरलेटिव क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी नाइन इफ ए डैश कंटेनिंग ए सब्जेक्ट एंड अब एक्ट्स एज एन एडजेक्टिव इट इज कॉल्ड एन एडजेक्टिव क्लाउस आंसर ग्रुप ऑफ वर्ड्स क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टीन लास्ट क्वेश्चन ए डैश इज ए कलेक्शन ऑफ वर्ड्स इन वन और मोर स्पेसिफिक लैंग्वेजेस आंसर डिक्शनरी थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग द वीडियो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल लाइक द वीडियो एंड मेक योर कमेंट्स